Arcadiana is Ali Bear. Welcome back. It is 539. There are so many fun places for kids to go this summer. And this morning, Al Abair, he's at the Children's Museum of Acadiana with a look at some activities for the kiddos. We send it to him. Oh, we've got the lab coat on Al. What are we getting into? <laughs> oh, yeah, Alex. This is when it gets serious. I got a lab coat on. I got Lori Litton sitting next to me. You know, science is about to happen. Laurie, what are we going to do? Al, we are going to try to make a lemon clock this morning. A lemon clock? I love that. A clock out of lemons. I made one off camera. It works well, but now I need your help doing the next one. Okay. Because we have to work on our, our new invention, the lemon clock that you wear. Yes. So we're going to stick our zinc and our copper. Zinc and copper. Correct. And what's going to happen is a chemical reaction. So we need to put our black wire in the zinc. Okay. Or our, our black wire in the zinc over here, and then put your red wire in the copper. Okay. Mm-hmm. Got and it. And so this is an activity that the kids will be doing this summer during our daily discoveries. Every weekday is going to be something new. So this is really cool. So if you come by one day, it'll be this, it'll be... Uh, art project, engineering project, and then we need to wire our white copper on this side to the zinc on your side, I believe, if we're doing this correctly. And you know, the cool thing is, if we do it wrong, we're going to get it right after absolutely, the break. Absolutely, absolutely. And this is the fun thing that I love about STEM projects. It allows kids and families to use critical thinking skills until they get it. Look at that, Al. We made our clock. Wow. Can you see that, Brandon? Is that coming out okay? Look. Wow. Now, do you have a, a band for this to wear on the We're, wrist? That, that's going to be the second part. We'll do that in our art portion of our theme. <laughs> That'll we'll be cool. We'll figure out how to make this fashionable. Now, why and is this working? Happen. I don't understand why a lemon makes a clock work. So we have all these electrons mm -hmm. going up. And the acid, the acidity in the lemon is kind of acting like a battery. And it's traveling up through the wires, through all the circuits. Similar to the circuit rod that we have. I love we this. We have electromagnets in our body. Nice. Blowing through. So when we do that, or if you grab one side and we touch, close Whoa! It, like that, it goes through. That's and science, guys. Fun. You could do this in a big group and it keeps going and you annoy I your parents it. with all the noise. Hey, so much fun. If you can annoy your parents, <laughs> you've hit the jackpot. Hey, we're going to go back to uh, Alex in the studio, you know, because I like to annoy like Alex and Lauren and Adam. So, man, that's great stuff. Back to you guys. Yep, so what he's saying is he's bringing that back. Okay, Al, sounds great. We'll see you in just a bit. <laughs>